People sometimes get confused on what the difference between the roots, zeros, x-intercepts, and solutions of a polynomial is. The roots or zeros of a polynomial are the values of the variable that make the polynomial zero. For example, the roots of x squared minus 5x plus 6, which is a quadratic, a type of polynomial, would be 2 and 3. If we substitute 2 for x in the quadratic, we will have 2 squared minus 5 times 2 plus 6. 2 squared is 4, and negative 5 times 2 is negative 10. 4 minus 10 is negative 6, and negative 6 plus 6 is 0, so the quadratic's value is 0 when x is 2. If we substitute 3 for x in the quadratic and simplify, we'll also get 0. There are different methods for finding the roots of a polynomial, depending on the polynomial. In this example, 2 and 3 were found by setting the quadratic equal to 0, factoring it as x minus 2 and x minus 3, and then, using the zero product property, setting the factors equal to 0 to find the values of x. Keep in mind that solving a polynomial means to find the roots. Thus, 2 and 3 are the solutions of the quadratic when it's set equal to 0. Remember that any point on the x-axis has a y value of 0. Because we're looking for values of x that make the polynomial 0, these values are x-intercepts, the x-coordinates of the points of a graph on the x-axis. 